Hello, I think we are live, Amy, though I can't quite see it yet. So if you're on Road to Kona, I'm gonna quick log into the page and see if you, if we are live. Okay, I think we are, Amy. So hello and welcome everyone. We are so, so, so excited to talk to you today on one of the tips and the um, things that I have found to be so helpful in clearing the clutter. So I'll tell you just a quick backstory. We did a little bit of this on um, at the Ruby retreat and it started me thinking of how I could really incorporate this in a way that was real to, um, to me and to how I can pre and present it. Because what I found was is that for myself, when I get really busy in life or really busy in my business, or I feel like there's so many things calling my name, I almost stall in going forward because I go into management mode. Um, and another way that happens is if I don't know what my next goal is, I kind of have an idea, but I don't know all the clutter that's on the road to that goal. I kind of get stuck and frozen. So what I did was I started, um, to map, I took the mapping that we learned at Ruby Retreat and kind of enhanced it to fit where I saw a lot of people were, were stuck or were um, needing the support and where I needed it as well. So what I did was before I hop on a Zoom with some of my people that wanted to, to, um, to talk and to strategize together, I said, I want you to have two things printed out. And Amy and I, Amy is my amazing goal, going to senior gold. Uh, she and I have done this now. She said right before we hopped on, she's been on three of the mapping um, Zooms that I've done and she's learned something different every time. So hopefully that we can cover all those things that she learned today. And we're gonna be going back and forth like I've done with her in the past. So what I had Amy print out was her back office, and I wanted her to print it out according to the levels. So organize your back office and then do level one, two, three, however much you want to do. I would do at least your th first three levels. If you have a smaller team, do your four levels. And then I had her print out her leads list and bring to the Zoom four different markers. Amy, you wanna show them what you got there? Right, okay. So. Amy's goal, next goal is senior gold, right, Amy? Yes. Okay, so what we did was we printed off her back office because Amy's been doing um, uh, plexus for a while. She's talked to lots of people. She had um, a nice back office going, but I said, Amy, do you know like where everyone is? And so I said, what I wanna do is I want you to know where everyone is that you currently have on your team because there's some people that maybe have their subscription turned off. Maybe they have quit. Maybe they have less than hundred PV, but these people at all at one time, all love Plexus. So before we go on to reaching out to more people, Amy, let's see how many points you have. So we know how many points you're going to do need for the next goal. Because a lot of times we have a treasure trove of points that we're not getting, but we could have if we knew how to reach out to them if we knew the verbiage maybe to reach out to them. So I want Amy to have a clear path towards senior gold. So Amy, um, hold up your leads list. So the first thing that we did was I said, I want you to take your, I'm gonna go to a paper that doesn't have highlighted, your back office, sorry, not your leads list, Amy, your back office. Okay. Okay, so here's mine. Your back office, according to level, that's, okay, there you go. And I want you to put a marker on choose your color. So Amy, what is your color for the people that you have that you think have quit Plexus? What color did you use? Yellow. Okay. So what I had Amy do, we're not going to, I normally have people spend like five to 10 minutes on every um, level, everything that we do while I'm on the Zoom, because I want my person walking off with some physical evidence of direction. So when you're doing a Zoom with your people, <laughs> take five, 10 minutes, whatever your time is that you've allotted to this team, to either the leg of a team or a person and say, we're going to take 10 minutes right now. And I want you to highlight a line on the top. Can you show us your uh, top of your page with yellow? And I want you to put those people to put, we kind of joked around dead on arrival DOA, 
but we've changed it to potential resurrection people because I'm going to give you some verbiage to maybe potentially resurrect those DOA people. So Amy did yellow on top of her paper and then she went through with just her knowledge of everyone that has quit or hasn't ordered for a long time and highlighted them. So do you want to hold up your paper for a second, Amy, just to let them kind of have a visual. So what Amy is picking up that paper, she knows exactly where to go to who is potentially dead on arrival, but potentially to resurrect. And we're gonna go through verbiage. Perfect, thanks, Amy. The next one, after we've done that for five or 10 minutes, I told her to put another um, um, highlighter color for those that are less than 100 PV. So what color did you choose for that, Amy? Green. Green, okay. So she had highlighted in green everyone that was less than 100 PV or when they ordered, they ordered less than 100 PV. So what we're doing is our goal is to know where every single person that, that Amy has ever signed up is at. So when she can pick up this list, she has an instant knowing where she's going to um, contact and put her time for each level as she systematically works through. So then I had Amy go and take, we spent some time where she was highlighting the less than 100 PV people on her, um, in her list that she's printed off. The third one was the people that were steady. So what color did you, that you can depend on? You know that you have those points every month. Amy, what color was that? Pink, of course. Of course, <laughs> there, that was pink. So Amy went through and she had highlighted every one of the people that she could count on those points in the letter pink. Okay, her page is getting very colorful, but she instantly can know where these people are. Then the last one that we did was sometimes. The people that order sometimes, the people that maybe you could bribe if you needed a rank up to order sometimes. So we're gonna try to get those sometimes people on. So Amy highlighted in what color your sometimes people? Blue. Blue, okay. Now, if you have someone that has a lot of customers or you have a lot of customers, you can make a list on your leads list of the customers that you could potentially work on turning over to ambassadors. And we may get to that today as well, but print that out on your leads list so that you know, have in front of you right now, everything that you need to know where you are for your next goal. So after we did this, I had Amy add up all the people, all, how many points that she has with her steady that she knows that she can count on point wise. Amy, did you do that? I forgot to tell you that for the Zoom. I'm at about 120 right now. Okay, so Amy's next goal is senior goal 250. So she has 120 steady points, right? But look at all the people in blue. That's <laughs> where we're going next. Okay. So the people that we go in blue, let's start first with the dead on arrival because, okay, no, first of all, so how many do you have in blue, um, Amy? Oh, a lot, actually. Um, Quick count while we do that. Um, count each category while we go on, I'll go, oh, I'll go into verbiage um, for this while you're counting and then we're gonna go over it and show how we set a picture, okay? So, Let's start with the potential resurrection people, all right? I like to look at things positively. Dead on arrival kind of makes me go, eh? But potential resurrection makes me go, eh, right? So potential resurrection because those people at one time have loved Plexus. And the reason that we're starting out on this week with this is because I want you to number one, map out the next eight weeks for yourself. Number two, we have an opportunity here with the virus to, to connect with people. Um, that are looking for answers for immunity. The world is gonna be literally more awake to the power of having a powerful immune system to keeping yourself healthy um, now than ever before, probably in many, 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 many years. So you can use this from now till whatever. So I will contact the, the person on my list that has not ordered for a long time or that has quit. And I say something like this, Emma, how have you been doing over this quarantine? Or you could just say, Emma, how's it been going with you and your family? We are having so much fun taking a lot of walks. I am so excited for spring to happen. Looking forward to putting in my garden. I'd love to hear how it's going for you and your family. 
I start out with a conversation. Guys, the biggest thing that I see that, that we all can continue to press in an improvement is how to have conversations and relationships because we are in the relationship business. We have a volunteer army. And I genuinely want to know where people are, where their heart is, because the more that I know where they are, the more that I can help them. So Emma answers, answers back and talks a little bit about her family. And I comment on that. And in that conversation, I say, that's awesome. Emma, I've just been sitting here um, going, over my, um, going over my business and I noticed that you still had an account with Plexus. I would love to work with you and your family and put together individual protocols for you to help you guys be in the best of health. Because I know that working together, you and I can get results. Um, if she said anything that led me into believing that they're, you know, with their health issues or anything, I will go on that. But if not, I would say, if that would be something that you could do, I would be honored to be the one to help you. If that is something that you're not interested in, I'd be happy to help you close your account today as I would, as you can save the yearly renewal fee. fee. However, Emma, I would love to work together on your health and with you and your family. Okay. What I'm doing is I'm doing the push pull. I'm letting her know that with very much confidence that if her and I could work together, we could have results. If, however, if that's not something she wants, I want to know where she's at so I can clear the name. I can know where that person's at. They're either in or they're out. Um, if I can help them or I can't. But my goal is I want to know where I'm at. I want to know where every person is. And as I'm going through this list, I am touching base with every single one of my teammates that are on, if, like for my team, for at least my level ones, working on level twos. But for if you have a, a smaller team, doesn't matter the level, contact them. I'm using this opportunity to see if I've missed not talking to someone um, in a while. So then I will have today, I will know where Emma is. Is she in or out? Can I count on that point or not? Um, if she's wishy-washy, um, we can talk about that later. But if it's, uh, you know what? I'm thinking me and my family probably need to get back on something. Let me talk to my husband. I'll get back to you. For today, I'm writing her name on my leads list because she is as big a lead to me as someone that is new. I'm not making money on her now. I'm, um, she's not ordering now. So she's technically a lead, right? If she's not, I, what I do for the cancellation form, guys, I get it in writing. Would you like me to cancel your account today? If so, all I need is the last four of your social security number. If there's someone super savvy, say, hey, can I send you a cancellation form that's in your back office under policies and procedures, under training, under resource library? Um, you can send them that. But if there's someone who's not going to fill it out, guys, there's some people I've been sending to for a couple of years. So what I'm doing, one guy, literally three years, um, I am just asking, getting in writing their permission to cancel. And just getting, filling out the information and sending it into cancel or sending it to them. But then I know if they're done, they're done. So I go on to the next person. And that's how I treat the potential resurrection. I do the rubber band. I'd love to help you, however, if you don't want to. And I end with, however, it would be my honor to be the one to help you and your family um, get back on track with your immune system, depending on the conversation. But that's how I give them either, either or choice. Okay. Uh, Amy, did you get your less than 100 PVs? Uh, yes. Okay, where are you at? So I have, uh, I have actually 21 maybes. That's was the, the blue you asked about. Um, so that would be 105 points. So add 105 to 120, what do we have? Uh, 205, 225. Right, you are 25 points away, potentially literally from senior gold. Which do is only five how, people. <laughs> right. And do you see how, do you see how Amy is starting to see, you know what, senior gold is not that far off. I may have 120 steady points, but gosh, I'm 25 points away from senior gold. And we haven't even touched the sometimes, we haven't even touched the potential resurrection people, right? So less than 100 PVs. Again, we're going back to the conversation. Hey there, let me pick a name. Hey there, Lydia, how has it been going? Are you having fun making family memories, depending on where stage of life I'm used to using the quarantine now? Um, or, hey, Lydia, how's it been going? I'm loving the spring weather, getting out there. I just spent, you know, talk a little bit about your family. I just um, sat down here and I've been going over um, my back office or I've been going over my business. And I've noticed 
that no 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 sorry scratch that I'm, I'm going hey Lydia how's it how's it been going it's been a while since you and I chatted I'm loving this spring weather loving getting outside taking lots of walks with my family how's it been going over this time I'm using the quarantine a lot now how's it been going over this time with you and your family's health are you loving the results you're getting with Plexus um, are you getting the results you started with Plexus it depends on the person but I always use one of those two questions um, because I want to know if they're not happy I want to know where they are so let's say that Lydia said, hey, yes, I'm loving my results with Plexus. I would say, hey, that's awesome. I love how our supplements work. Tell me what it is that you're taking on a daily basis. Because I know that they're not having 100 PV. They started out at one time with it, but I want to know why, what it is that they're taking. So instead of just saying, well, I noticed you don't have 100 PV, I'm saying, tell me what it is that you're taking. Are you happy with your results? Awesome. How, what are you taking daily and how much of each are you taking? Because I want to know the doses. Maybe they're taking like one ProBio5 or one BioCleanse. I want to know what it is. From that conversation, if they're happy with their results, I say, awesome. What is it? Like a lot of times, um, if they're not taking a multivitamin or if they're not taking a probiotic, I'll go this angle. So is your family taking, what is your family taking for a multivitamin? And then they'll tell me what it is that you're taking. You say, hey, do you like it? Tell me what you love about it. Um, and I say, hey, I just wanted to let you know, one of the reasons that I am seeing such, uh, that I've seen such good results with, with Plexus, with our multivitamin is that it's activating our microbiome. And I know with all this virus things going around, I love that even my multivitamin is targeting our gut bacteria. Would you be opposed to me sending you a video on our multivitamin, just so that you know um, what it is that, that we have available? Um, or I'll say, hey, what is it that your children are taking as a multivitamin right now? I just wanted you to know, because I know as a mom, you are so on top of it for your family. Um, do you, are you aware that our children's multivitamin has three strains of probiotics that really boost the immune system? I'm loving that our kids are getting this, especially with all that's going around. And we start that conversation. And what I have had guys with that conversation of not mentioning 100 PV, I'll give you an example. I was talking to a lady the other week and she was, um, struggling with hormone issues. And I, through the conversation, I found that she took slim, hit and miss, she stopped taking it. Um, and I said to her, I said, well, you know what? I can totally understand why it was you weren't getting results because of um, what it was that you were taking. But I could, I'd love to help you turn that around because I've known with the hundreds and hundreds, probably thousands of women that have had hormone results, you can absolutely do that. And I led into a conversation. She had started out with, we don't have enough money because all we can afford is ProBio5 and BioCleanse. When it ended up, when she understood, just with the conversation, never mentioned 100 PV, that she could have results by adding in the Slim regularly and the Ease and the multivitamin, she ended up that night ordering Slim, Ease, multivitamin, and an extra ProBio5. Whereas before, it wasn't that she didn't have the money. Sometimes that's a problem, but literally she didn't understand. I never mentioned 100 PV. What I'm leading into with these 100 P, less than 100 PVs then, is once they're back on track, um, I will say, hey, and you know what? Uh, to this lady, I'll pretend her name was Lydia. Hey, Lydia, do you know what? I, I wanted you to know that with you and I working together to um, help your situation that you were dealing with, um, with this order, you're going to be getting about 150 free perks every month because you have your subscription on now that you're going to be getting free products that you can use for your family and you can use for yourself to further your healing, right? That right there, I didn't have to bring up 100 PV. I didn't even have to bring up the perks that she's losing. I just turned it into, guess what you're going to be getting now, Whitney? I'm so excited because you can use these free products towards your goals. If they're not interested in through the conversation, um, and they're just super, super happy with the ProBio5, the BioCleanse, or the ProBio CA and the BioCleanse, then I'm saying, hey, that's awesome. I am so excited because we love those two. I do one of two things. I'm saying, is your husband and your kids on the probiotic as well? Um, and I try to, I broaden their spouse, their thinking, is your husband and your children, the probiotics, you're just having, um, you can share a bottle of BioCleanse with the family, just having you guys in the probiotic is going to make a big difference. Sometimes that'll be 100 PV, but if not, I'm saying, I am so happy that you are loving these. I love them myself. Um, with wholesale is meant to be 100 PV. If you're happy with this, why don't you and I switch you to a customer? You'll save the yearly renewal fee and you can um, start to um, get your products as a customer. So 
that I know how I end that is, is you have no obligation for any price requirement as a customer, which seems to sit you, suit your situation perfectly. So that's the 100 PV. Doing this, guys, I, I don't know. I'm trying to look. I don't know if I hardly have any that are less than 100 PV in the two pages that I've been working through because mm -hmm. this conversation has either switched them to a customer or gotten them back on track just with conversation. I'm not going in talking about how they're not meeting the 100 PV requirements. I'm talking in with a conversation. Tell me how it is. Are you loving your results with Plexus? So Amy can look at her page now. And what's your color, Amy, for 100 P, less than 100 PV? Green. Guess what her IPA is? Her IPA today is going to be getting those potential 21 people. Guys, that is so close. So now, um, Let's go on to the sometimes. I use the same approach with the sometimes people. I say, hey, how's it going? Do the family thing, talking to them. Hey, I'd love to know, are you happy with the results that you're getting with Plexus? Awesome, I'm so happy to hear that. Um, or, hey, I'm so sorry, I would love to help you get the results because I know that working together we can. Tell me a little bit, what is it that you're taking every day and what is the dose that you're taking? Awesome, okay, let's, here, oh, let, we can tweak it here a little bit. Would you be opposed to telling me what it is that your diet's like? Um, maybe there we can do something there, maybe make a couple tweaks. And so I start working with them as a person. Invariably, the reason that people are sometimes is they simply have not had enough back and forth with you to understand the how much better their results could be, how much healthier their family could be if they just had a little more interaction and you get that by asking questions. Remember John Maxwell says, great leaders ask great questions. Uh, uh, some, I just, I, when, I, when I'm having this conversation, I always try to bring in, what is it that your children are taking? What about your husband? Is he struggling with energy? Hey, I would love for you and your husband to be able to feel good together. You guys can thrive this summer, right? So asking questions very often will bring in those sometimes into full times. They just need a little bit more of you and interaction and conversation. So Amy, did you have some sometimes? 13. Amy. I know, Amy, right? There's my rank up. <laughs> there is Amy's rank up. So guys, can you see this, how this is going to be huge? So let's pretend, let's just cover perks and then we're gonna pretend that Amy's not at her rank up yet, okay? Gosh, Amy, we're gonna talk after this soon. I know, so, I know. <laughs> so let's talk about how to approach perks because perks guys, are going to be very often less than 100 PV. I do perks the same way. Hey, I, I check it every single day because you wanna catch them on day one. Hey, Tabitha, how's it going? How, is, how are you doing through this quarantine? Or if it's during the summer, how are you loving the summer? I just was thinking about you today and I wanted to see, are you loving what you're, the results that you're getting with Plexus? Tell me how it's going. What is the, one of the things I use is tell me about the rhythm that you've got working plexus into your day-to-day -day routine. And through that conversation, I will find out either if she dropped below 100 PV or why she turned her, her subscription off. Because I've had a lot of people that turned it off that weren't aware of plexus. A lot of these are people that were started way back when. And I'll say, hey, Tabitha, you know what, with what you're taking, you, are, you would be qualifying for, for um, free product every single month. If you're stockpiled, what we can do is turn your subscription on, but put it to the end of next month. That way with your subscription on, you're not going to lose these free perks. And next month, when you've used up your products, your products will come and you'll get an additional 100, 150 perks, whatever it is. I just wanted you to be aware that girl, you've got some free products coming your way. I can help you get it today. Or we can set that free product for when your, when your um, subscription goes next month. See how I'm, it's conversation. It's not, hey, you know, you're losing. No, let's tell me how it is. Tell me if you're liking your results. That's how I do with perks. So let's pretend that Amy needed 25 more points. The next thing that I do is I had them go through and we took like five, 10 minutes, depending on the time and the size of their team. I want you to put a star beside without assuming anything. Put a star beside the people that you think that you could have a conversation and maybe interested in getting their products paid for or maybe interested in um, having an income, especially with the way that the economy is right now. And those are the people that we're going to target, not target, we're going to reach out to next. And with that, um, if you have time, I help them uh, re put a message together with this $6 million Plexus is giving away. 
Hey, Lisa, I know it's been a while since you and I have chatted. I'd love to hear how it's going with Plexus. We have the conversation. Lisa, I wanted you to, I know that um, you and your family are on the supplements and my heart would be that you guys could be on your supplements with no money out of product, out of pocket. Plexus right now has a stimulus plan where they're giving $6 million back to our ambassadors. And through this all, I know so many people are more aware of the, the need for a strong immune system. I would love to talk with you and help you um, share with some of your friends or family or answer any questions that your friends or family may have, may have and putting together a protocol for them and their children. Um, I Would you know a couple people that would be interested in even just learning more? We're having an online event and I would love that they can learn in their pajamas how it is that they and their family can have a stronger immune system. And if they have any questions, pop them in a chat with you and I, we can, I can help you answer all of them. You don't have to know or to answer anything. I'll do the work for you. My goal is to see your success and you and your family be on the products without money out of pocket. And I know right now, if they're in a situation that this 325 or 600, $700 could mean a lot. I would love to be able to help you get that. Me and you working together can do it. And then when they go through, they will find a bunch more people that instead of them getting those extra five people, help your people be successful. And that's how you can rank up. It's about helping your team. It's not you always getting those extra five people. Yes, you should be working every day on it. But you know how much more um, powerful that is if your people can be successful with you and you can go up together and they can start seeing an income. Guys, that's how you get momentum too. You get momentum by helping your teammates see that their dreams have the actuality, the possibility of coming true. And this is an awesome opportunity to do that. So Amy, do you have your leads list there? I do. So, yeah. All right. Two things. So while, while they're going through, I'll say, okay, Amy, you only need five more people. Let's just pretend she's done that. She has the potential she's going to be reaching out to, but then I have them go, okay, so Amy, you are only 25 points away from rank up. Let's pull out this leads list that they have filled out before they hopped in the Zoom. Guys, your time is valuable. My time is valuable. I don't get on a Zoom unless they have the leads list filled out before I, they hop in the Zoom with me. And this back office thing filled out before they hop into Zoom with me because my I want to be able to show them and um, model to them what a real leader does. A real leader's time is valuable. And so I have all the time in the world for them, but they have to come prepared. So Amy would reach for her leads list and we would go, if we had time that day, uh, schedule out the time to help her, if she's unsure, formulate a couple messages for these people or put together a plan where she tells me who she's gonna reach out to that day to reach those goals. Now Amy has a complete mapped out plan to know exactly what it is that the goals that she is going for. And that guys is how you clear up so much confusion for yourself, do it for yourself and also for your people. One last thing that Amy and I were talking about today was as you're going through these people, all the less than 100 PVs, all the sometimes, and all the potential resurrection people that actually are considering coming back on, they go on your leads list because they're not counting for points for you right now. Okay. You might have a separate section where you have for people that were at one point in time on that are less than 100 PV, but you have a category that every single day part of your IPA should be those people because they are actually a very warm hot market for you they're not a cold market that you're courting those are very likely to be people that are going to come back on your team so those go on your leads list just like a lead amy did you want to say something to that um i just love i love all of the mapping i love how it just connects you with um like obviously we've just lined out how many people that i have as potential that need to, you know, get back on. If I had all the people on board, it would be amazing. But it's just been incredible to me just to start dialogue with people, just to connect some of the people, you know, they're not all my level ones or level twos. And right. it's, it's just what it's doing is making us work the back office, which is something right. we, we should be doing all along. But uh, learning this has been really, really helpful in just knowing, uh, really just to focus, knowing knowing where to connect, who to connect with. It started so much dialogue with people. And and really, because I'm a yellow, I like to help people, right? Um, I've really come across a lot of people that I didn't know were struggling in an area. They maybe bought 
uh, one product here and there, um, but because I reached out to them, found out that Vital Biome is really what they need, particularly right now, um, and it's just helping people. So, right. Um, I love, love, love mapping. I just think you guys are gonna love this. You're gonna really, um, you know, like you said, Jess, it's it's bringing your team along and not having to get all those those points by yourself. Uh, it's been great for me to have this right in front of me because I have been looking at people, um, understanding that people want to get their need to get their products paid for. I was one of those people. I needed to get my products paid for and. Um, that, that other people that are on my list need that as well. And so it's been great for me to have that in front of me just to be able to systematically go down and contact each and every person, um, just intentionally reaching out to everybody that's ever been signed up underneath me. It's a great way to do it. That's so true. And you know, one of the things that I have, when you're talking about reaching out to people, I've had such good conversations and such good connections again, because as your team goes bigger, guys, the bigger it gets, the harder it is to, to really be able to, to con connect with everyone. And so this is really good to do periodically just to find out exactly where your team is. What I've been doing is intentionally when I'm talking to them and they're bringing up scenarios of health issues i am tagging them even though i could answer i am sending them videos that they watched in the beginning but they haven't watched a while like i'll send them um send someone to one again on vital biome that they were like oh you know i really got to get back on that one i forgot how good this is thank you for sending that i'm tagging them in the information groups on a testimony pertaining to it because i want to get them back even the algorithms of seeing what's in our information pages because if they've been on it for a while, you guys, there's so much going on in Facebook. So tag them on a story, send them a video, even if they've seen it before. I sent someone the Fab Four and the Vital Biome video again, and they hadn't watched it for a long time, but they're like, oh my goodness, this is so good. I forgot about this, how good this was. Absolutely, I'm so glad you reached out to me today. Mm -hmm. So even though this is a time, guys, to connect on so, so many levels, but A, make sure they end up in somewhere in the conversation knowing about perks, B, get them back in connection with the information groups. C, uh, make sure, like try to send them a video or something. And also one other thing that Amy said that jogged my memory, if you're getting into level twos and you're reaching out, you guys should have connected with every one of your level twos. I am working through a long list right now. And so what it's called, it's called tap rooting, but it's also called connection. And what's happening is a lot of good connections and conversations are coming. And so when they talk to me, I say, hey, that is a great, I introduce myself as their diamond upline. I'm here for their success. I'd love to get to know them better. And as they, the conversation goes, if they ask me a question, I'm saying, that's an awesome question. I'm going to pop um, your sponsor in here so that we can chat together. And you and I can, um, you can have 24 hour or like very much, um, what's the word I used? Um, connections that if you have questions, one of us are available to answer you and we want to unite together for your success. And um, so I am creating a community right there again, referring them back to their sponsor, but knowing that they have us both there for them. And it's again, connection, connection, connection. That's where our success is. So this is getting a little bit long. I'm going to go look at questions. Hope this helps. Amy, thank you so much for hopping on and um, sharing how we did this before and what it's helped you for. So have a great day, guys.